Portland yet, yeah. but um, can you talk about, you know, what, how it kind of came about that you're coming here and how you feel about, you know, joining the Timbers? Yeah, um, this off season I hit free agency and in talks with a couple teams, but, uh, you know, I came out and I visited Portland and I got really good vibes. Uh, it's always a really fun environment to come and play in. Um, so I'm really excited. It's a great opportunity for me. It's a really exciting team, a lot of talent. So I think we can do big things. You're not the first free agent that's chosen to come here. Um, right. What, what do you think it is about this club that kind of is attractive for someone yeah, who so is in nice. a point where they get to choose where they want to go? Um, from the outside looking in, um, amazing fans, amazing field, um, the environment, soccer culture. Uh, that's what you look for as a player. Um, coming from Kansas City, you know, we had the same thing. It's a good soccer culture, and that's what you want to be surrounded in every day. You want to fight and have that pride of the city. So uh, that was easy. That was an easy decision. Is it, is it strange for you to be with a new club after so many years with Kansas City? Was it was it tough to make the decision to, or to end up to be out of contract and decide to um, leave? Yeah, it's, it's a little weird. You know, I've been in Kansas City for nine years, so this is uh, my only transition professionally. So uh, meeting a lot of the guys the last few days, it's, it's been an easy transition. Uh, Good, good locker room, a lot of funny guys. Uh, then we're out on the pitch, it's, it's to work, you know, that's, it's an intense environment and that's what I like. So you've scored for the Timbers and against, and against the Timbers as well. Yeah. Is that kind of a fun, has anyone given you any jokes uh, about that yet? People give me crap all the time. Uh, my only three goals professionally are against the Timbers or for the Timbers. So hopefully we'll keep going for the Timbers. Um, and just with how much time you spend in Kansas City, um, Obviously, you've been in this league for a while. Caleb's talked about you know wanting to bring in leaders as well as you know players that fit the it fit in into the system. But um, what do you kind of leadership do you see yourself bringing here? Obviously, you're a new guy right now, but you are a veteran in this league. Yeah, um, I would say my my leadership qualities. It's, I'm a quiet leader. Um, I'll pull you aside. I'll, I'll talk to you, and you know. But I'm demanding as well. You know, on the field, I want to win, and I'm gonna do whatever it takes. I'm gonna lead. I'm gonna direct. I'm gonna do whatever it takes. So, I think I lead by example as well. Um, so I'm gonna come in, put my work in every day. So hopefully the young guys and other guys can see that. Obviously, Alvis Powell has been kind of the starter at right back here for a number of years. Um, what do you see as kind of your role coming in here, with, with what you've maybe talked to the coaches about and. Um, what are you going to, I mean, what kind of thing, how does it, the competition kind of, yeah. uh, how do you react to that? It's always good to have competition. Uh, Alvis is a great player. My job is to, you know, make him better, to help the team and push him. And if I'm going to step in, I need to do my job as well. So it's going to be a competition, but he's a great player and I want to make him better as well. It's only going to help the team. If you had a chance to kind of get to know him yet, there's not something that you're going to want to do, given that you guys will be kind of competing for the same spot. Absolutely. No, we're teammates. Uh, I think he's, his locker's next to mine. He's a good kid and he's got the world of potential, so it's going to be a fun, fun year. And you've had, you had, a, had some injuries throughout your career, um, and particularly the Achilles injury a few years back, haven't necessarily seen the playing time since then. I mean, how have you dealt with these injuries and moved forward uh, in your career? Uh, just being strong mentally, you know, having a good support cast and learning to lean on them and trust them. Uh, that's kind of, you know, that's something I had to learn, but uh, that's really what I've done. What? The coming back from the Achilles, missing a full year. I mean, does do you feel like that experience made yeah, you grow at all as a player? Just having to deal with such a long, prolonged injury. Absolutely. I, I think what I did, I learned how to how to coach. I I, I watched a lot of games. I watched a lot of film because that's all I could really do. So I learned to pick apart, you know, transition moments and defensive moments, and just try to real really be a student of the game more so than I ever have in the past. And that's what what I did. I think they described you at some point in Kansas City as carefree and uh, laid-back California guy. But do you yeah. think that's changed over your career with you know the injuries and just the more time in the league and things? Like um, that? Yeah, you're always evolving as a person. I think that's something true to me though. Like I'm always a really laid-back person, but on the field I want to win. I want to compete. Um, but yeah, I'm a people person. I like to get to know everybody and everybody. Um, so yeah, that's that's me. And uh, in, in meeting the guys, have is there anyone that you who, who's your roommate right now? Vitas. Vitas. Yeah, he's awesome. So, he's a good dude. Has it has it been? Have you guys had much chance to meet the guys, or has it really just been this last two days? Yeah, you're always you know around them. You're eating dinner with them. You're in bands 24/7 with them. You're in the locker room, and everybody's here. A lot of, a lot of new guys, so you're you're getting to know everybody as much as you can. That's that's our job. That's our role. And where do you feel like you are with your career? The, you haven't had the playing time a few 
for the last few years, but you're a few years out of the major injury. I mean, how do you feel in terms of your health and what you can bring? Uh, my body feels really good. Um, should be age-wise in the peak of my career, so it's a, it's a fresh look for me and a fresh start, and uh, a lot of challenges lie ahead, so I'm excited to get to work. Great. Thank you.